Growing a green finger. I guess North Carolinans consider thumbs as fingers or something like that. So he wants the finger. I'll give him the finger. <laughs> See, I couldn't resist that. Whoa, okay. That definitely is a huge green finger or something. Oh no. Whew. That's definitely not a finger. Anyway, Growing a Green Finger is a channel that covers the gardening spectrum of colors from brown... Okay, okay, we get it. You'll like compost. Brown, well, you know, all the other colors that aren't brown. <laughs> Those roses look like a sock puppet. See it? You see it now? Like, <laughs> he took this and he made this. And most of the time, there's a busy little schnauzer and it helps out in the no-dig section of the garden. The dog also helps out in the watering, and, you know, there's a lot out there to be watered and cleaned. A self-proclaimed middle-aged idiot learning to garden. I'd say he's quite a whiz at persuading dirt to give him food, you know what I mean? Like using a gigantic waffle iron to start seeds. Now, he says in the video not to try it at home because he doesn't know what he's doing, but I think he's on to something. I mean, I've learned an awful lot watching Growing the Green Finger. Like, his backyard looks like Teletubby land. <laughs> and how to tell a bat pumpkin from a worse one? That thing looked like somebody... Or maybe... Now, some of his videos are a little weird, and you're going to wonder which are the spoofs and parodies, and which ones are the normal ones, you know, if there are any normal ones. And even if you don't learn anything new about gardening or landscaping, the videos are still a little entertaining. This channel will make you consider growing a green finger of your own. Check it out. Logan Kidder. Logan Kidder is one of those people you don't have to try very hard to figure out. His channel is as uncomplex as he is, whether he's hunting or showing life with cows or gold fishing. Ernie, you mean fishing for gold, right? <laughs> nope. Gold fishing. Like, for goldfish. Really, he rescued the ecosystem in upstate New York, but he also kept the glitter carp alive. And his hunting... It's a marvel to see. Ah, maybe next time, Logan. Well, see, the reason, you know, he doesn't catch anything is because he's doing it blind. <laughs> when he isn't hunting and fishing, he shows some of the aspects of work. Hey, my gynecologist has one of those. That one looks bigger, though, and rustier. Before his cows, the doctor's office comes to him, and even with the high-tech gadgets they have, you still have to, uh, <laughs> they play Etch-a-Sketch some kind of weird in New York. <laughs> That'd be a good truth or dare, though. Or, whenever you get bored on the farm, just play Mouth of Truth with the cows behind and just hope nobody's lying. <laughs> Look at that glove! She was still explaining all the science -y stuff, and I was, like, screaming at my TV app, Take the glove off! <laughs> so if you want to see more of what's inside the cows on the outside, or you're into the outdoorsy stuff, or even the occasional YouTube challenge, put on your gloves and see what's inside Logan Kidder. Oh, <laughs> that didn't sound right. The channel Logan Kidder. But wear gloves. <laughs> oh, goodness. House of Wilds. House of Wilds just celebrated their one month anniversary on YouTube by putting half a pig into the freezer. In just one month's time, House of Wilds, they've shown us how they care for their critters and they've given us clips of life inside the home. Peyton really has a lot of irons in the fire, and as a pediatric nurse practitioner, a lot of the cards on the table as well. Sometimes YouTube gets the nurse practitioner card, sometimes the home side card, and sometimes you're going to see her doing it all with both hands full. So if you're interested in a family-oriented homesteading nurse practitioner wild card, House of Wilds is going to be right up your alley. Most likely to succeed at gardening channel? 
your outdoorsy, hands-on, hands-inside beef cattle channel, the up-and-coming, all-around homesteading nurse. Are these your people?